It was the fall scene round the world. Jennifer Lawrence was so nervous in 2013 on her way to collect her first Academy Award that the Silver Linings Playbook star tripped on the first step to the Oscars stage. She recovered quickly and laughed the whole thing off. But seven years later, the 30 year old actress is reflecting on what went through her head at the time. They call my name and immolated and in shock. You kind of black out, Lawrence said last week on the Absolutely Not podcast of learning she had won her category. I actually don't remember what that moment felt like when they said my name, and then I fell and it just erased everything from my mind. My full brain went blank. I can look back at it now that I'm a little bit older fondly, but for a very long time the fall thing was very sensitive. Jennifer Lawrence, the star says Trump changed everything about her political views after making it to the stage, Lawrence was met with a standing ovation. You're only standing up because I fell on the stairs, she told the audience. I feel so embarrassed. Reporters asked her backstage if she had fallen purposefully. The actress jokingly replied, absolutely. What do you mean, what happened? She added look at my dress. I tried to walk up the stars in this dress. They waxed the stairs. Earlier that evening on the red carpet, she had told reporters that her stylist took six inches off the mermaid style train of her Dior gown because it was so long. Lawrence recalled seeing Anderson Cooper discussing the ordeal on CNN a few days later, where he, too, wondered if the fall had been a stunt. It was so devastating because it was this horrific humiliation to me that took away. I don't know if I'll ever have the chance to make a speech like that again, Lawrence said on the podcast. That didn't feel good for me not to have a speech. But the two have since settled the mishap, Lawrence said she later confronted Cooper at a Christmas party when she was all fired up, but he immediately gave her a wonderful apology. My friend told me that a vein was bulging out of neck, she said adding I think we're good friends now. On my end, we're all good. Still, the actress joked that her final words on her deathbed will be menacingly whispering Anderson Cooper. Contributing, Maria Puente.